Well, today we're at St. Croix State Park and we're just wrapping up two days of spring training. Um, we worked with our summer naturalists and our year-round naturalists. DNR naturalist training includes skills needed to lead many of the state's popular ICAN programs. Today's training focused on the archery in the parks program, which was started about five years ago thanks to legacy tax dollars. And we were trying to figure out a couple of good uses for them in our parks and somebody suggested as part of the outreach effort to start the Archery in the Parks program. Minnesota boasts 67 state parks, many of which host various ICAN programs throughout the year. So we're training people today here in the park. We're certifying them as basic archery instructors and then they're going to go off into whatever park they work at and they're going to be teaching the public how to shoot archery. From youngsters to the elderly and every age in between, archery is a hobby all ages can enjoy. And really it's so popular that we don't have enough equipment to do it in every state park every single weekend like we'd like to. One of our goals is just to get people more interested in the outdoors. And there's different ways to do that. Not everybody likes to fish or hike or camp, but this is a sport that can be done outside. It can also be done indoors. Chris even credits the archery program with bringing families together over a newly discovered shared interest. I'll hear them telling their kids, we have an archery club nearby, we could join it and do this as a family. I see that bow hunter parent come with their kids and they're bringing their little eight-year-old daughter with and he sees how she is just lighting up doing this and I see him light up and he's like, I could be doing this with my daughter. So he's connecting with his kid. That's perfect. For more information on any of the ICANN programs, be sure to visit the DNR's website.